What is good everybody and welcome back to the channel. We are about to embark down to Miami, Florida to go shopping at some of the most expensive designer stores in the world. Some of the craziest designer stores in their designer district. Now we're going out of Miami, Florida. It's basically my birthday this weekend and I wanted to go ahead and do something crazy. Go to Miami with my fiance, go on a nice vacation as well as do a cool video where I actually treat myself because I do buy a lot of stuff. You guys see all these great sneakers and stuff, but that is more like a business thing. I usually sell some of them. But this is going to be where I'm treating myself to shopping like a millionaire. This wouldn't be possible without sponsors of this channel. You guys supporting buying stuff off the website. So thank you guys so much for that. I'm so excited to see what we can get down there because this is gonna get a lot little bit crazy. Before we head down there, I want to let you guys know that we are giving away a pair of these Jordan 1 Laker SBs right here. If you guys don't know what these are, basically they changed to the Chicago colorway after all the color wears off. Super dope shoes. Something about three, four hundred dollars. If you guys want to get these, all you have to do is subscribe to the channel. You have to go to this picture on my Instagram. You have to follow me there. And then you have to leave a comment down below tagging two friends and like the post. If you've already entered the giveaway by seeing it before, you only have to do it once. We're only accepting one entry for that giveaway, but now let's go ahead and finally head to Miami, Florida, get out of Atlanta and check out some new scenery. All right guys, it is pretty early. I haven't had my coffee yet. It's about 6.15 right now. We're about to head out. We're about to leave the beautiful city of Atlanta, head to Miami. We have a flight at 9.51 a.m. So I have to get my coffee down that way. My fiance wants to get her coffee down that way. So we're gonna split ways when we do that. We gotta go get the car, put the bags in, and uh, I'm not gonna try to film that much. I wanna enjoy the weekend, but also I'm thinking about putting out a video Sunday. So we'll see if this footage ever gets anywhere. <laughs> interested to see what Pinky's about to do when we walk outside. So you might have to take my uh, suitcase so I can call him. <laughs> hey! <laughs> nice to see you. I was <laughs> All right guys, so now we are in Miami, Florida from Atlanta, Georgia. I've got some family that lives out here. My grandfather actually lives here and we're gonna be here for the weekend staying at the Miami Beach edition. I can tell you guys that now because I won't be here by the time that you see this video. We're about to do some insane shopping here. So let's go ahead and get wrapped up. We're about to hit to the crazy shopping district out here. So let's go. I was trying to get away from the music, but I really can't. So we're about to head out to uh, the more expensive shopping district here. I'm trying to figure out which route I wanna go. There's a flight club out there. There's like a Balenciaga. It's probably fogging up right now because it's kind of hot out or it's humid out let me see there we go so we're gonna be heading out um, my mom is about to arrive she wasn't supposed to come but she decided to fly in so kind of celebrating birthday graduation for Sophie so just hanging out now until then it's like 10 30 no nothing is open until 11 so we can't even do anything so we're just two early birds out here we're not out till like 5 a.m. so we're gonna wait and go from there headed to the design district and uh, stinks out here it smells from the seaweed but we're headed out now
get over here. I'm not sure how security is going to be, but we got a bunch of the stores out here. We're going to try to low-key film, look at some stuff, but security might come around. I don't know. Maybe they're used to it here in Miami, but this is a big shopping district. They don't have as big as a shopping district like this in Atlanta, so this will be interesting to see. They got Louis Vuitton, Dior, Gucci, everything. So we're going to see, check it out, and uh, go from there. They don't really have much in here, so I don't think I want to get sneakers. I want to get something a little fancier, so we'll see. All right, so we just got out of the flight club. They're cool in there. It's a small store, and he's yelling, um, and we're just going to shop around now and see what we have. We'll, we'll update you when we go any other places. I don't know what the direction is right now, but we're just going to be shopping. I don't know if I want sneakers because I bought so many recently, so we'll see. I wouldn't wear them either. I'll wear these though. Those are hot. I like it these. Those are hot. Gorgeous. You're going to walk away. Walk down the stairs with this and out the front door without being caught. Balenciaga hit the sale. They're about 30% off, so we got to spend about $5.90 something. A little bad. I like this. This is something I was looking at online, so got the sale in the store. Look at this store. Cool, nice lights and stuff. So, next door, let's go. Christian George spent about 1755 80 something like that, pair of shoes and a t-shirt. So I'm excited. We're gonna put that together tonight and uh, still continuing on. Rolex store, zero dollars. I actually contemplated getting a watch. I have a Rolex. This is like a very cheap one. I looked at some in there. I don't really like them. So I might look into APs, but that will not be for a while. Uh, we looked in there for a while though. I like some of the watches, but zero dollars in there. Just thought I'd let you guys know. And we didn't film because it's Rolex. <laughs> This is the new Aventus that comes out in a few days. It actually comes out tomorrow. Let's get it early and a few samples. So hyped on that. Get the new smell. I didn't even get the biggest bottle. The biggest bottle for like 500 bucks. But I think we're gonna go to Aesop next maybe. And then uh, over to like Kith in that area. Aesop, 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 221.49. Lotion, soaps. <laughs> Our house is gonna be fancy. Got Sophie a nice little facial cleanser. Thank you. Maybe some ice cream for Sophie, and then we're gonna hit like Kith and stuff tomorrow. But right now, I think we might be done over here. I couldn't find anything at Prada, couldn't find anything at Louis Vuitton, so that's uh, might be it for now. Feels so good out here right now. Cartier, 1893.90, the most expensive piece. You guys probably are not expecting what this is. This is a per purchase for the future, so guess down below. It's my first Cartier purchase, and uh, we just decided to go and do this, so it's kind of cool what we got. We'll show you that later. Small piece that's very cheap for Cartier. It's one of the, che probably the cheapest things you can buy in there, so uh, that, that's gonna wrap, I think that's gonna wrap it up. We're gonna go to Kith now, but for this area, we're done though. Just got in here, so if we got our coffee, and Pinky's right here. Yeah. No words. No words for him. Oh, Frenchie. Oh, oh hi. It's a Frenchie. Came here to take a thousand photos and now I'm leaving. Pinky's picking us up. We're done over here. And uh, Pinky's my grandfather, if you guys don't know. And we're going to dinner and stuff tonight. I should probably record something like that because it's a birthday dinner and it's a very expensive, but here comes my grandfather. Alright, guys.
guys, so we're headed over to Kith right now. I'm not sure how they're gonna feel about filming. They seem to have pretty tight security in there, but we haven't had any words from any of the uh, people in the designer stores. Nobody's really said anything, so I'm thinking we might be able to find something here. It's a retail store though, so there's not usually like a ton of good things, but we'll see if there's anything. Oh, there's a nice little wraith right there too. That's hot. All right, let's get over there. Try to make this one quick and uh, show you guys everything that we got. Five twenty-eight fifty-eight. 58 a pair of shorts. Ruigi, you make good quality products, but uh, this was a tough one, a pair of swim shorts that you can wear short. They're really expensive, but this is the last size. We're, ball we're balling out. Ugh, that was a tough one, but we're here. I think that's gonna wrap it up, so this might be our last store. We'll see. All right, so this lighting is not as graceful as I'd like it to be. It's very bright on me, but I'm wearing some of the things that I got for dinner tonight, for birthday dinner. It's a little bit extra, but Got the new sneaks here. Still got a couple of things in the bags over here, but we didn't even realize we were gonna have to fly home and we bought all this lotion and stuff. So we're gonna have to check it. And then they gave me like four or five of these Aventus Cologne samples. So I'm gonna be using this tonight instead of uh, cracking open the new one. So pretty excited about that. Now it's time to get to dinner. Definitely not bringing this camera, but it should be a nice evening with the fam and fiance. <laughs> All right, guys, after a very long day of shopping, this this is too much. This is a lot of shopping. I don't go on vacation too much because it's kind of expensive and I like to be in my workflow and stuff like that. And so being able to do this through like sponsors and stuff like that through the channel, I'm very thankful. And to kind of treat myself for my birthday is a nice thing to do. So I want to show you guys everything we've got. This again is pretty crazy. This the stuff that we got. So if you guys first saw from Dior, we got the nice high top sneakers right here that kind of look like Converse. I actually wore these last night, so that's why they're out of the box and everything. I don't know where I'm gonna put all this stuff. My suitcase is full before we even got here, so I don't know exactly. We're gonna have to try to finesse. We're gonna check a bag because like one of the things we got is lotions. It was kind of not a smart move. But other than that from Dior, we have a t-shirt. They had one more t-shirt in there. That's all they had in the t-shirt. So the shoes were 1,050 and the shoes were 550 and then there's tax obviously. So you got that nice Nice, like packaging right here. I think that's really cool. It says Dior on there. I hope you get something really cool like that for how much you spend. Five fifty for a T-shirt. That's the most expensive T-shirt I've gotten. You guys know I got like this shirt, which is the same price, but it was through Farfetch. You got that nice logo. Now the shirt is good quality and stuff. It's a little thin, and the logo is a nice print. But I, where they're charging five fifty, the name. That's that's all I can say is the name. But this is a cool shirt. This is like the last piece they have from the collection, so I was glad to be able to get it because somebody actually returned it. So I'm glad to you know pick up something from there. I wanted to get something from Dior. I wanted to hit some stores that I've not hit before like they don't have a men's Dior store where I live I could get it at like Neiman Marcus though so and then after Dior we went over to Balenciaga and we went to Balenciaga walked around I think the guy that worked there knew my videos he's a little bit older but he's like said keep killing it and he knew my name before I walked up so I assume he watched the videos but they had a sale going 30 to 50 percent off so this was 30 percent off this is a bag originally 750 down to 519 and I really love this if you guys know one of the shoes that I have this will look really good with it the only thing I had a hard time justifying is because I don't really wear stuff like this much and that is a shoulder bag and this is a like volt colorway it's not like super aggressive but it's still a nice like really nice I think it's a nice subtle color it is simple Balenciaga's designs are like super simple so for the price you're like why is it that much but that's a lot of these designer things you see right there nice little shoulder bag very simple plain canvas material a leather one but it was like twelve hundred dollars and i was like nope sale only please then we decided to go over to the creed store now if you don't know what creed is it is a cologne and they just recently came out with a new aventus now i've had aventus for about two two and a half years now and they did like a refresh i guess and this was 347 for the 50 mil yeah the 1.7 fluid ounce this is something safer to travel with i like having the smaller bottles to be able to like i'm not going to use a whole massive bottle so having like a smaller one like this. Right now I have another one over there. It's called the Green Irish Tweed. But got a new Aventus. My Aventus actually broke. It was on the countertop, fell over, cracked, it all fell out. And that was uh, great. I, I didn't see it, so I didn't catch it before everything fell out. My dad also got a bottle. I put him on a Aventus or a Creed two years ago. So after that, we went over to, where was it? Aesop. Now, this is, spending this much money on soap is kind of ridiculous. I've always wanted some, you know, soaps and stuff from this company because I know that they're known for nice stuff. This is soap. And I never thought I'd ever spend this much money on soap, but I did it for me, for Sophie, for our home, so we could have a nice little uh, collection, nice little show off soap. 
soap. It's like a flex soap. This one is like the Balenciaga soap, I would say. Nice little flex, and I cannot get it open. I'm not gonna take this out of the packaging, but this is basically a uh, lotion and soap kit right there. I'll show you exactly what it looks like we got another soap. It's basically this, the biggest size that they have, and two of these ones, a lotion, one's a soap. I don't know, fancy stuff. And I got Sophie a nice little uh, parsley seed facial cleanser. 225, soap 225 blows my mind, but I knew going in there that it was gonna be that expensive. The individual bottle is like $75. So literally, I buy refillables from the grocery store that are like $4. That's what I'm gonna do. When these go out, I'm gonna buy the refill from Publix Throw it in there because I'm not buying another $90 bottle. After that, mm, Cartier. Now, this is one that I don't know if you guys would expect, like I said earlier, and I cannot use this until, uh, you know, a few months from now. I bought a Cartier ring, and this is one that I wanted to get for a specific reason, and that is because Sophie and I were getting married in September, and I wanted to go ahead and buy my wedding ring, which is this Cartier white gold ring, which is very expensive at $1,900, $1,700, but you got to think a woman's you know, engagement ring costs a lot more than that. I mean, it doesn't have to, but for the most part, their wedding rings and their engagement rings are way more expensive. So I thought I was gonna just get a cheap one, like a cheap, you know, sterling silver. But then I thought, you know what? I'll treat myself as well. So I got this nice Cartier love ring, which is very nice. Cartier is very good quality. They have good warranty. So that's why I wanted to treat myself with that. It's something I'm gonna have on my finger for the rest of my life. So I, you know, why not not cheap out on it? So we had that from Cartier and I'm not gonna be able to wear that for a few months until we're actually married, but glad we got to get it here. I think taxes are a little bit cheaper here. 2% cheaper here than where I live. And then lastly, we have Kit. And at Kit, I showed my dad, or I told my dad how much this was. He was like, are you kidding me? This is one I'm kind of still like, eh, I don't know. I don't know why, eh, I don't know. Of all things, this is one, this is as much as that t-shirt. Five, or 520 bucks for a pair of rude swim shorts that double as shorts. They have a nice lining on the inside. Root is amazing quality, and I know that. And these are even sold out. I'm surprised they're sold out there. And the reason you're getting that high price is the good quality, the brand is very good. And I do support Root. I, I have a lot of different Root shirts, but I usually get them on the sales because I like to try to get a little bit of a deal. This is still hard for me to like swallow. Like This is a hard pill to swallow, and there's pills right here. And then lastly, Sophie got me a nice little birthday gift I want to put on here. Shout out to her. So the hotel we're staying at is the Edition in Miami, and they have these nice scents in the hotels. I am I love the vibe of a hotel. This Aesop soap is like hotel soap. This is the smell of this hotel here, which is amazing. So we got this reed diffuser. Sophie got it for me. So thank you so much, Sophie. She's back there for that. Really love the smells. We have like five diffusers in our apartment right now. So I'm excited to go ahead and add something new. I just love the vibe of smell. My parents left today and uh, we're heading home tomorrow. So we're going to enjoy our time here. Put the camera down and then I fly to New York a day after this. So in next week, you're going to start seeing some New York content. So I think I'm going to check back in before we leave and home. So we'll see you guys there.